Ever wonder what Wall Street and the NASDAQ really are and why they're so important? Let's start by saying that stock exchanges aren't just about men in suits shouting numbers across a crowded room. The role of stock exchanges in our economy goes well beyond that. They are the beating heart of our financial system, the gathering place for buyers and sellers of securities, like stocks and bonds. Think of a stock exchange as a grand marketplace. But instead of haggling over apples and oranges, traders are negotiating prices for securities. These exchanges make it possible for millions of transactions to happen every day. This is where your favorite tech giant raised money to build its empire and where that new green energy startup hopes to get its big break. Now let's talk about raising capital. Companies list their shares on a stock exchange to raise money. They sell a part of their business in the form of shares to investors who believe in their potential. This money can then be used to fund expansion, research and development, or any number of business activities. It's like a continuous crowdfunding campaign, but on a much grander scale. And let's not forget about investment opportunities. Stock exchanges give everyone, from the billionaire hedge fund manager to the college student investing their first hundred dollars, a chance to own a piece of a company. They provide a platform for us to invest in our future, whether that's saving for a dream home, funding our child's education, or planning for a comfortable retirement. But stock exchanges are more than just a platform for trading securities, they are a reflection of our economy's health. When stock prices rise, it often means businesses are doing well, and the economy is booming. When they fall, it could be a sign of economic trouble ahead. So, stock exchanges play a pivotal role in our economy, facilitating trade, raising capital, and providing a platform for investment. They are the pulse that keeps our economy alive and thriving. So buckle up as we dive into the world of U.S. stock exchanges. Let's begin our journey on Wall Street, the financial heartbeat of America. Nestled in the heart of downtown Manhattan, it's more than just a street. It's an icon, a symbol of ambition, power, and the relentless pursuit of wealth. But Wall Street is not just about money. It's a place where dreams are made and fortunes are lost, where the pulse of the nation's economy beats the strongest. In the late 18th century, Wall Street witnessed the birth of the New York Stock Exchange, fondly known as NYSE. Originally formed under a buttonwood tree, the NYSE has grown to become the world's largest stock exchange, where the giants of industry and commerce come to play. From the railroad companies of the 19th century to today's technological titans, the NYSE has always been the preferred home for those seeking to make their mark. It's where multinational corporations like IBM, ExxonMobil and Walmart have laid their roots and flourished. On the trading floor of the NYSE, the air is electric. Brokers shouting, phones ringing and the constant hum of activity. It's here that the fortunes of companies and the livelihoods of millions are determined all in the blink of an eye. The NYSE is not just a marketplace. It's the epicenter of global finance where the world comes to buy, sell, and trade in the lifeblood of capitalism. Stocks, it's a place where the principles of supply and demand are played out in real time, dictating the ebb and flow of the global economy. Beyond the hustle and bustle, the NYSE is also a barometer of economic health. It's a reflection of our society, our dreams, our fears, and our aspirations. When the bell rings at the NYSE, it's not just signaling the start of trading, it's echoing the hopes and dreams of every investor, every entrepreneur, every individual who believes in the power of capitalism. Wall Street, a symbol of American capitalism, is only the beginning. From the traditional trading floors, let's move to the digital marketplace, NASDAQ. With its spunky acronym standing for National Association of Securities Dealers Automated Quotations, NASDAQ is the trailblazer of the digital revolution in stock exchanges. Born in the year of 1971, it was the world's first electronic stock market, a radical departure from the traditional face-to-face -face trading. NASDAQ is often associated with technology and innovation. It's a digital haven for tech companies, a vibrant marketplace where the likes of Apple, Microsoft, Amazon, and Google's parent company Alphabet have chosen to list their shares. The reason? NASDAQ's emphasis on technology companies. It's a place where the future is traded today. Unlike conventional stock exchanges with their noisy trading floors and frantic hand signals, NASDAQ operates entirely online. It's a virtual marketplace, where traders buy and sell stocks from the comfort of their offices or homes, or even while sipping a cup of coffee at a local cafe. The trading floor is in the cloud, accessible to anyone with an internet connection. 
but don't let the absence of a physical trading floor fool you. NASDAQ is a powerhouse in the global tech industry. It boasts the listing of more tech companies than any other exchange in the world. It's the home of the NASDAQ 100 Index, a stock market index that includes 100 of the largest domestic and international non-financial companies listed on the NASDAQ Stock Exchange. Through NASDAQ, technology companies have raised billions, fueling innovation and growth. It's where startups morph into tech giants, and where tech giants continue to expand their reach and influence. In this virtual marketplace, ideas are valued, innovation is rewarded, and the future is shaped. In the grand scheme of things, NASDAQ has redefined what a stock exchange can be. It's a testament to the power of technology and how it's transforming the world of finance. It's a marketplace that's not bound by geography or the traditional 9 to 5. It's a 24-7 global trading hub. NASDAQ, where tech giants rule and the trading floor is virtual. Beyond Wall Street and NASDAQ, there's a whole universe of other exchanges. Now you might be thinking, wait a minute, there's more? Absolutely. And they play a pivotal role in America's financial landscape. Let's start with the Chicago Board Options Exchange, better known as the CBOE. Established in 1973, this is the place where options trading really took off. You see, options are financial contracts that give investors the right but not the obligation to buy or sell an asset at a specific price. The CBOE is the largest options exchange in the United States, and it's a heavyweight in the financial world. But the CBOE isn't just about options, it's also home to the Volatility Index, or VIX. This index is often referred to as the fear gauge, because it measures the market's expectation of future volatility. So, when the financial world wants to know how bumpy the ride might get, they turn to the VIX on the CBOE. Next, let's jet off to Kansas City, home of BATS Global Markets. Despite the spooky name, there's nothing scary about BATS. It's one of the largest stock exchanges in the world by trading volume, and it's a leader in ETF trading. BATS is a thoroughly modern, fully electronic exchange that has made its mark with innovation and efficiency. Then there's the Intercontinental Exchange, or ICE. It sounds cool, and it is. ICE operates global exchanges, clearing houses, and provides mortgage technology, data, and listing services. These exchanges, along with others like the New York Stock Exchange, American, and the NASDAQ, OMX, PHLX, may not have the name recognition of Wall Street or NASDAQ, but they play crucial roles in the financial ecosystem. They offer different products, cater to different market segments, and provide much-needed competition. So, while Wall Street and NASDAQ may grab the headlines, remember that they're just part of the story. These other exchanges might not be as famous, but they're vital pieces of the U.S. financial puzzle. And that's a puzzle that keeps the wheels of American finance turning. But what do these exchanges mean for you? Let's dive into that. Stock exchanges, in essence, are the lifeblood of capitalism. Coursing through the veins of the economy and keeping our financial hearts beating. They are the platforms where businesses raise capital to grow, innovate, and create jobs. And here's where you come in. As an individual investor, these exchanges are your playground, your battlefield, your stage. Now you might wonder, how does the performance of these exchanges impact you? Well, think of it as a ripple effect. When companies traded on these exchanges succeed, they generate wealth that trickles down to their shareholders. That's you, the investor. Your investments grow, your wealth increases, and your financial future brightens. Conversely, when these companies struggle, your investments can take a hit. It's a delicate dance of risk and reward, triumph and tribulation. But it's not just about your personal finances. The performance of stock exchanges is also a barometer for the health of the broader economy. When stocks are soaring, it signals that businesses are thriving, consumer confidence is strong, and the economy is humming along. When stocks tumble, it can indicate economic troubles are looming on the horizon. So how do you tap into these exchanges? Well, it's simpler than you might think. Thanks to advancements in technology, anyone with a smartphone or a laptop can invest in stocks through online brokerages. You can buy shares in companies you believe in, sectors you think are poised for growth, or index funds that track the performance of the entire exchange. It's a world of opportunity at your fingertips. But remember, investing in stocks isn't a guaranteed path to riches. It requires research, patience, and sometimes a bit of luck. But with the right approach, it can be a powerful tool for wealth creation. The world of stock exchanges is more than just numbers. It's about the opportunities they create for investors like you. So are you ready to jump in and ride the waves of the stock market? The next move is yours. 
So, we've explored the bustling universe of US stock exchanges. That's quite a journey we've taken, isn't it? Let's take a moment to rewind and revisit the key points we've discovered along the way. First, we delved into the importance of stock exchanges. These colossal financial platforms that serve as the meeting grounds for buyers and sellers. We understood how they act as the lifeblood of the economy, facilitating the flow of capital and paving the way for businesses to grow and thrive. Then we took a virtual tour of Wall Street, the financial heartbeat of America. The New York Stock Exchange, with its iconic image and its long, rich history, is more than just a market. It's a symbol of economic power, a testament to the entrepreneurial spirit that drives this great nation. Our journey then led us to the NASDAQ, the digital marketplace that revolutionized the trading landscape. With its cutting-edge technology and focus on innovative sectors like tech and biotech, NASDAQ represents the future of trading, where transactions happen at the speed of light and geographical boundaries cease to exist. We also acknowledge the presence of other major U.S. stock exchanges, each playing a unique role in the grand scheme of things. From the Chicago Board Options Exchange to the BATS Global Markets, these platforms contribute to the diversity and robustness of the U.S. financial ecosystem. Lastly, we talked about the role of these stock exchanges in your life. They're not just abstract concepts or distant entities, they have a direct impact on your financial health your retirement plans, and your dreams of a secure future. In the grand tapestry of finance, these stock exchanges are the warp and weft that create the intricate patterns, the highs and lows, the opportunities and challenges. They are the arenas where fortunes are made, where dreams are realized and where lessons are learned. Remember, the stock market isn't a game of chance but a game of informed decisions. So keep learning, keep investing, and keep growing. We've just scratched the surface of the fascinating world of stock exchanges. But remember, Rome wasn't built in a day, and neither is a successful investment portfolio. It's a journey that begins with understanding the basics and then diving deeper into the complexities of the financial world. Consider this, you wouldn't set sail on a ship without a compass, would you? Similarly, navigating the vast ocean of financial markets without the right knowledge is a risky venture. So, continue to educate yourself. Watch our other videos on financial literacy, delve into books about investing, and keep abreast of the latest market trends. Every bit of knowledge you gain is a step towards making informed decisions. It's like arming yourself with a financial compass for your investment journey. So go ahead, take the plunge into the world of investing. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more insights into the financial world. Until next time, keep investing and keep expanding your financial knowledge.